Hey guys, welcome back to Persona 3 Portable. This is Caffeine Gaming. And last time we defeated the Lover's Vision Quest, as well as fused some Persona to start uh, filling out our Persona Compendium. I'm not quite done with that. I didn't do anything over, um, like, off screen or anything like that. We're going to be doing the Chariot and Justice uh, Vision Quest today. I'm going to go ahead and keep this guy equipped. Uh, I talked about him last time. He's got the weapons master, but he also has a few like uh, all strike attacks. Uh, heavy strike and yeah, these two right here. Um, which is pretty useful. He also got a couple things here that will increase attack and defense, which is pretty nice actually. We might uh, use him a little bit more. Uh, with me, I'm bringing Yukari, Akihiko, and Mitsuru. Now, quick thing here is you get to bring your main character, but you can also bring anybody uh, in your party, I think except for Koromaru and Ken, so Yukari, Junpei, Mitsuru, Akihiko, or Aegis. Um, I'm bringing Akihiko as our debuffer, Yukari as a healer, and Mitsuru because she's got some uh, dual attacks. Um, if you remember this one, let's go ahead and open this up. There's two. There's Justice and there's Chariot. And they are a tank. <laughs> Come on. It's Arcana is justice. Wait, it's Chariot? What the? Why am I sensing two entities? It doesn't make sense. It makes perfect sense. So when we did this originally, um, we were in, we were under the underground. So yeah, that's what's going on here. We've done this before. Let's go ahead and start by decreasing their attack. We should be okay. Uh, we're just gonna go ahead and use physical attacks right now. All right, he's gonna try and get out the entire party. What? That is not comfortable. Okay, let's. Oh my gosh. No, what the heck? All party members? I've never seen that get hit, or that hit everyone. So I'm kind of in shock right now. Don't let that happen. <laughs> At least we've got plenty of Mipatra now. Okay, let's go ahead and keep going here. I believe we've got decrease in the damage attack, so we're doing fine here. And they should split here shortly. I won't miss. Um, we're gonna just go ahead and attack. I don't think we need to lower. <laughs> Though, if they keep using Tentrafu, then maybe we will lower their uh, hit chances, because why? There we go, there's the separate. Separated into two. Okay, so. The vehicle and turret are different types. One's chariot and the other's justice. They seem to be coordinating their attacks, too. Please, be careful. Okay, so we've done this before. I'm just gonna go ahead and briefly go over this. On the right here is Justice. They null light and dark and have no other strengths or weaknesses. On the left here is Chariot. Also nulls light and dark, no other weaknesses. So we get to do pretty much whatever we want. Suggestion would be to do dual attacks, like this one, because they can bring each other back from the dead. So <laughs> we're gonna wanna use pretty much any Mog. Um, elemental attacks or like anything that will hit both of them. Alright, hopefully no, that's not good. <laughs> I think the one on the right can also heal, but I'm not sure. Justice. Well, that evens that out. That hurt a lot more than I was expecting. Wow, <laughs> so that missed. All right, let's go ahead and get back up here. Please we'll be okay, be we'll use Yukari to heal here in a second. We're gonna use Vicious Strike again. Now, one of the things that I just thought about, let me check something here. That's what I thought. Their attack and defense are back up. I didn't think about it. Uh, last turn, we actually want to use Akihiko to lower the attack and defense so we don't have that happen again. 
So let's go ahead and heal on up here. And let's go ahead and have him lower the attack. At least. Not have that happen again. Alright, let's go ahead and keep using group attacks. These guys are both level 80. So, just be cautious there. Power charge! That's bad. Let's go ahead and use Vicious Strike again. We could use the other one, which is the Akasha Arch one, which I don't think it matters. Let's try that one next time. Uh, I don't think we need to heal. Let's go ahead and use Wind. Of course we missed. Let's go ahead and um, I'm going to de decrease their hit rate because I'm going to hope that that will make it a little bit more difficult for them to, to hit um, because of that power charge. Not happy about that power charge, <laughs> by the way. Just in case you were wondering. Oh, they're reuniting again. Never mind. Yay! Anything? Okay. There's no text. Uh, back here again. Attack and defense is down. So let's just go ahead and go back to using physical attacks. Oh, nice. Um, we don't need to heal yet. Let's just go ahead and strike. I wasn't sure if the attack and defense would return to what it was. Ooh, we're gonna get a crit here. I think it'll knock him down. It did not. Okay. I wasn't sure. Poison. Oi. I don't think I have anything that will heal everyone of poison. Um, which that's a pain, but that's okay. We'll be fine. Well, we were doing- oh, they're sagging finally. Okay, let's just go ahead and keep going here. We should be fine to not have to heal until next- next round. Let's go ahead and decrease the attack. Can't believe they hit everybody again. I am not happy about that. They might separate here, I'm not sure. Oh no, they're gonna try and get panic on my party. I don't think the whole um, status effects will stack, but I don't remember. Jeez, that fast. You missed? Okay. Let's just keep going here. Now I should get defense down on them, but I think they're gonna separate here in a second. Now I'm a little nervous here, because yeah, I'm letting myself take damage. But I think they're gonna separate. Yes, they are. Okay, good. He's got lips on the back of the, of the one. Okay, good. So let's go ahead and we're gonna use Vicious Strike here. Yes, the enemy's down. Well done. Again. That one's down there. Let's. Uh, we should be okay. Uh, not Gale Slash. Let's go ahead and use this one and see what happens. We might be done here. I think it ended with one hit point. Woo! And we won! And that's how you beat the Chariot and Justice um, one here. Now, I'm sure there's other ways about, you know, you could go about doing that. Uh, but yeah, we gotta absorb ice from that. Now, the next one here is gonna be the Hermit Door. Um, that guy's level 85. We probably will be fine with that one, but I'm not gonna do that uh, right now. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and save. So I would suggest saving after every boss battle. That is just a personal opinion. Now, let me go ahead and show you the date. It is currently the 20th and we have a few other things that we need to do. Um, I want to finish up the social links before I come back in here. So we're almost done with Empress and for Aeon, we are currently at six. We've got, I think it's going to be the 28th when we finish up uh, Tartarus, or finish up the social links. And that's going to be when I go back into Tartarus because I'm going to want uh, to fuse a bunch of stuff at that point. Um, we need to, well, there's a couple things that I don't know if we're going to do. First of all is this stupid quest. Uh, there's a katana inside Heaven's Door, and I'm probably going to have to find this one off screen to, to finish this because this one... I want to say the chance of actually being able to get this katana is like 6% because you have to go to floor 3 and 8 or 3 or 8 
to find it and it's got to be in a gold chest which has already got a very low percent chance of spawning and then it actually has to be in the gold chest which is also a very low chance so let's get out of here we're gonna go ahead and we're just going to return to the dorm for now um and do a couple things and hopefully i did everything right so that we'll get a special event here shortly Mitsuru came into the classroom I'm sorry to ask so suddenly, but can you come with me? There's sure. something we need to discuss. What happened? Uh, you want all of us, or just her? Just her for now. Huh? You wonder what she wants with just you. Regardless, you decide to follow come her. Come with me to the student council room. Okay. Off we go. Isn't it kind of weird that she'd only want to talk to her? Probably some big, important student council business. Nah. Maybe so, but Senpai was acting a little weird. She had that look she gets when she's keeping some terrible secret. Ah, you worry too much. Well, if the high muckety mucks don't need us, might as well go home. Muckety mucks, hey, really? wait a second, Junpei. According to the seating chart, if she's not here, you have to clean up for her. Have fun sweeping the hallway. No. What? Where did that rule come from? <laughs> uh, I believe in Japan, students have to help keep track of like janitorial stuff. So yeah, the students actually have to like sweep the hallways, dust the um, the erasers and stuff. Gakuka High School Student Council Room. There is no one here but you and Mitsuru. There's Ooh, something romantic. you have to know. Except for this music. Do you remember the girl named Chidori who was with Strega? Who can't forget Chidori? I don't mean to alarm you, but the fact is, there's a chance that she may wake up today. Excuse me? Chidori might wake up. I know what you're going to say, and yes, we did see her die in front of our eyes. However, her body began to undergo transmogrification a few days after the incident. So she's not dead. For the past few weeks, she's been in a state that is neither living nor dead. Um, how did this happen? I don't know. It may be related to her persona abilities, but that's mere speculation. But what I wanted to talk to you about is your opinion on how to break the news to Yuri. You see, she's probably... Um, phone? Ringy, ringy, ringy. <laughs> it's your cell phone Mitsuru rang. Mitsuru here. I see. Yes, I understand. That was the hospital. They say she's just awakened. It's unbelievable. But although we had confirmed her death, it seems Chidori has come back to life. Um. Did I hear that right? No, Chidori. Chidori, Chidori is. Huh? Is this a joke? Some kind of trick? No. No. It's not a joke or a trick. She is currently recovering in the same hospital as before. He's going. But, Iori. She probably. Chidori. Chidori's uh, alive? Uh-oh. Uh <laughs> okay, so off he goes. Ch uh, Junpei ran off. Uh, Let's see what Junpei, happens here. what about your cleanup duty? Guess it's your turn. Jeez, what's gotten into him? Well, yeah. I guess it's a moot point now. We should probably but follow. Perhaps it's best that he found out this way. I think I'll head to the hospital after this, too. Could I ask you to come along? Yeah, sure. You decided to go to Tatsumi Memorial Hospital with everyone. Everyone? Wait, did I, like, send out a text? Get over here! Chidori's room at Tatsumi Memorial Hospital. You caught up to Junpei, who was taking deep breaths outside the room and pulled him aside. Huh? Chidori is sitting in bed, looking thinner than before, but with a healthy complexion. Her damaged endocrine system and other internal organs have completely healed. Oh, hi. She's still weak, but there's no more danger of her dying in two years. Whoa. Is it really you, Chidori? I'm not dreaming, am I? Dreaming? It's true. It is you. Chidori. Huh? Who are you? <laughs> <laughs> I thought as much. Transmogrification is the proof that one lacks potential. I suspected that this might be the case. 
This is Mitsuru-san and Junpei-kun. They were your friends last year. Friends? My name is Chidori Yoshino. I'm sorry, it hasn't quite hit me yet. But it seems I don't remember any of the past few years. It's as if I was dreaming for a very long time. So there's two pathways here. This is the good path. Chidori Yoshino. So if you did the four, three, four uh, flags that I mentioned about doing, um, this seems happens. all of her memories after she awakened to her persona are gone. She remembers everything that happened before then. But as for you all... Iori. Nah, I think... It's better for her that she doesn't remember. All that stuff about fighting and pills. When you're having a nightmare, it ain't a bad thing to wake up. I didn't say it was a nightmare. Don't put words in my mouth. <laughs> it was a dream of meeting a kind, warm person at the end of a long tunnel. I can't remember it clearly, but I wanted him to be happy. And I... I think there were flowers. A room filled with them. Oh, that's sweet. <sighs> Chidori, take it easy. You don't have to force yourself to remember. Flowers in a room. If she remembers that part clearly, then maybe... Hmm? Do you remember when she'd use her power from time to time to make flowers bloom again? She'd always do it for the flowers in her room on the days when Junpei-kun would come. Uh -oh. The flower she touched would be mysteriously preserved. That's why I kept them all for research purposes. But after research the autopsy, purposes. I put them all on her chest as a tribute. And thinking back on it, it may have been that night that she began to transmogrify. So she put power or like her life into the flowers. Power to share one's life with others. And basically reabsorbed it. Could it be that she reclaimed the life energy she'd given to those flowers? Well, I can't prove any of it. But compared to how she was before, she's changed. The loss of her power is part of it, but more than that. Are we doing this right in front of her? Excuse me, are you talking about me? <laughs> we were talking about how you want to live now. Huh? What do you mean by that? Of course I want to live. I have to find the person in my dream someday. I can't lie in this bed forever. He's right there! Well, I mean, Supposing kind of. Supposing you do find him and meet him, what then? That's... <sighs> That's none of your business. Oh! Story. Two hearts reunited. It's a miracle. No, it's a victory. <laughs> Chidori. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Poor Chupe. <laughs> I, I, I can't help it. This, this is seriously the happiest moment of my life. <laughs> He's gone. <laughs> Small surprise. Huh? <laughs> oh, there's Yukari. There's Fuka. You can hear sniffling from outside the hospital room. <laughs> Where's Akihiko and Ken and all this? Hello. What's up, Ken? All right, so I think that's going to be it for today. We have... That was a special revival event. If you... I, if, I think if you don't... Um, I actually don't remember what happens if it's the bad ending, but I don't think it's nearly as uh, touching, quite frankly. But yeah, she doesn't remember Junpei because she's lost her memories of the Dark Hour. This is what would happen to us if we lost our memories of the Dark Hour as well, is we lose all of our memories. Ryoji talked a little bit about that, about if we killed him, we would lose all our memories. But we would be peaceful again, and that's the whole point that we saw there, is she's in peace, she's peaceful now because she's lost all her memories. So, very interesting. Anyway, so that's all for today. Um, in the next few episodes, we're going to be finishing up um, the two social links. I'm going to be deciding when to go back into Tartarus again to do more of the vision quests, uh, do more fusing, and do... Well, okay, there's two other things that we're going to be doing. I want to defeat the Reaper one, well, not one-on-one, -on -one, but mono fist-to-fists rather than using Armageddon. Um, 
which we should be able to do once we level up a little bit more. We are pretty decent level, but not for defeating the Reaper. We should be able to defeat him. We really need to fuse the right persona, though, for that, because he's not going to be easy. Um, additionally, we've got a bunch of doors, so we want to finish up the doors. And then we also have the ultimate opponent, which we have not faced. So we're going to be doing that. Um, we should be done by with Persona 3 probably by the end of December um, at the rate we're going. Because once we get all that done, we'll also be finishing up the bot, the the actual boss Nyx and all that kind of good stuff. And I don't think I'll be doing a second playthrough uh, of this unless I play the male character and show off the social links then. Um, but that I might take a little bit of a break since this has been going on for so long. All right, so I will see you guys uh, next week, uh, tomorrow, a couple days from now. I don't know, whatever. Bye.